Y'all know buckwheat, and if you don't, well, you sure as hell gonna know right now once we start talking about this. Why is buckwheat making the news? Well, buckwheat, uh, is buckwheat, baby, he's making the news. Not for even showing up, because somebody said his name. Turns mm. out that the utter mention of buckwheat's name is enough to get people riled up. Why is that? Because, well, if you use it in a certain way. Buckwheat oh, is a G. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. As you know what I'm talking about. Oh, Lord. All right. <laughs> yeah, you can look at this in a lot of places, but I'm getting this from next with Kyle Clark. And Kyle is very serious. <laughs> but Kyle is very serious about his buckwheat. <laughs> at first, I thought it was Ellen DeGeneres. <laughs> oh, man. He does look oh, like her eyes. Yeah, like, you, if you glance real quick, you're like, oh, wait, wait. Yeah, that's true. That's crazy. Yeah, I think she's also in the Venom trailer. <laughs> He's in the Venom trailer. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, man. But yeah, but uh, very serious about his buckwheat. Called another legislator buckwheat. You're not allowed to fire until fired upon. That is when your life is threatened. I'm getting there. Don't worry, buckwheat. <laughs> he called somebody, uh... and there was some black people in the chamber. This is, this is, uh, <laughs> this is Representative Richard Holtorf, who sat up there and, and looked at the, with dead face looked at somebody in the chamber and said, "Hold on, buckwheat." <laughs> we'll get to you, Ote. Uh, oh. <laughs> I was like, boy, I I buck his goddamn weed. He said something like that to me. And mm. people, listen. I'm on let me let me pull up this man right here. So buckweed is a word that you use against black people too? If you knew, if you knew what buckweed was, first of all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that's some I see your ass at three o'clock shit right there. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> that's some that. shit. When you wait, that is his. You wait for his ass in the hallway. <laughs> hey, 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 where you going, Alfalfa? <laughs> hey, yeah, hey nah, Spanky, it's me. <laughs> it's me, Buckwheat. Come in. Yeah, <laughs> and, Come in. and just in case somebody before I even show you, before I even show you why people riled up about Buckwheat, let me just show you the man. Just in case somebody asking out there. Do you think that's racist? What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> you take a look at that goddamn ten gallon ten gallon redneck hat he got on. That got that f- southern general mustache, that goatee he got. Man, this picture here is calling everybody the N word. <laughs> <laughs> and just in case you need more context here, so. I'm talking about, oh, buckwheat, man. No, man, look, why you saying that's racist? Just stop. Buckwheat's that charming, endearing character that Eddie Murphy invented on Saturday Night Live. <laughs> she having a good time. <laughs> she like, go and talk like that to me now. <laughs> you in the bedroom, baby? Yeah, I tell him. <laughs> <laughs> Talk buckwheat to me. Talk <laughs> buckwheat to me. <laughs> <laughs> now, Lee, take off your toes. <laughs> this is not the adorable creation of Eddie Murphy. This goes back to the Little Rascals, and some of y'all already know this because of the Little Rascals movie from from the nineties, I believe. But man, buckwheat. Listen, buckwheat. Buckwheat was buckwheat <laughs> <from> back. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to this kid? <laughs> he told that poor boy, open your mouth and your eyes wider. Yeah. <laughs> wider. Oh my God. Sorry, Corey. Oh, no, oh. I know. No, I know. So, <laughs> but, hey, look, Buckwheat was Buckwheat back in the yeah. day. Buckwheat was a product of his time. But Buckwheat yeah. kind of coonish. You know? <laughs> oh. Yeah. There's a little yeah. little coonish, whether it was whether hey, whether it was accepted at the time or not. Y'all see this shit. Mouth wide open and bug eye and hair all over the place. <laughs> but and his name is he's named after a goddamn breakfast grain, Buckwheat. <laughs> <laughs> it was Buckwheat and another dude named Farina. <laughs> yeah, Farina. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm just probably didn't have a Negro just called Oats. <laughs> <laughs> now if you black in a Dressed like this in front of a bunch of white people calls you this. <laughs> you gonna be just a little bit irritated. <laughs> just a tad bit. Just a little bit. Just a yeah. little bit. You might yeah. as well just say 
Yeah. Yeah. Now, we we definitely have to talk about that afterwards. Yeah. And by talking, I mean slapping them up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I said today, you know, listen, I'm not going to get mad if you call me the N-word or anything like that. I'm going to have some composure. But when you think you got enough power over me, and you wearing that racist ass facial hair and that hat, and you sitting up here calling me buckwheat in front of a bunch of white people in the middle of a of a chamber meeting. Then get the fuck out of here. No, you gonna apologize for that shit. Now how now I have to beat your ass. Yeah. <laughs> like, no shit, call me buckwheat. I'll catch your ass out in the hallway and have your ass looking like this. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't know you'd be here. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, come on, man! It's some shit you just they because the dude did that because he because he thought like I have no I have no respect for these black <laughs> in here, and I'm gonna show him. Yeah. yeah, and he got that little plexiglass in front of him that gonna that's gonna protect him. Nah, that ain't gonna help either. Yeah, yeah, not, <laughs> it, yeah. No, it's definitely a case where you like, all right, that's the one you gotta calm yourself. Like, all right, we gonna handle this later. I'm sorry, you don't even earn the dignity of my fist. I wouldn't hit you, but I pulled my hand back and back slap the f out of you. Bitch slap. Oh, yeah. Bitch slap you just to let you know how much of a bitch you are to me. You don't do that shit. You do not do that shit. And said it, if you listen to what he said, it said it like an old racist cowboy too. Hold on there, Buckwheat. <laughs> I'm getting there. Don't worry, Buckwheat. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. You're that goddamn no. southerner. I'm getting there, Buckwheat. I'm getting there, partner. He's going to spit tobacco soon. <laughs> <laughs> All that good stuff. Oh, a black person's head. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> mm, man, that's, that's a problem. No, you don't deserve my foot in your ass. You don't deserve my fist. You deserve a, the, you deserve the back of my hand with the loudest slap. That goddamn chamber will echo. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's when it, that's when it cuts to the trees and the birds are flying. <laughs> <laughs> that's some condescending shit. Yeah. No, motherfucking no. I'll show you disrespect. I'm sorry, y'all. You don't go, don't stoop on people's level. But goddamn, sometimes they try to put you so low. The only way they know you coming up is if you slap the f out of them on your way up. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes, you know, a good hand to the face changes your <laughs> mind quickly. <laughs> Tell me you don't look at this shit and see the silver world on the face. He's calling you the N-word right now. <laughs> <laughs> with his eyes. Jeez Louise. Yeah. Hey, out of here with this, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. Hard on everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Representative Richard Holtorf trying to take it back. <laughs> trying to take it back to the day. <laughs> Good old <Yeah>. days. <laughs> you thought buckwheat was bad. I got some real words for you. <laughs> meet me on the yeah. <laughs> yeah, meet me on the street at noon, partner. <laughs> got a couple of N-words I want to shoot at you. <laughs> <laughs>